Hey clarinets, today we're going to learn how to read a fingering chart for the clarinet. This is really important because this is how you are able to learn to play any note on the clarinet. We'll start by reviewing our left and right hand fingers and where we place them. So on both hands, we label our fingers T, thumb, and then one, two, three, and pinky. So take a moment to review thumb, one, two, three, pinky on both hands. We're going to start with the left hand. As a reminder, we are not pressing the key on the back. We are placing our thumb on the hole. On the front of our clarinet, our left hand, we have our first, second, and third fingers cover these holes. For now, our pinky can rest on this key. A little bit later, it will rest down towards the bottom joint. Here is pictures of what it's going to look like from the back and the front. On our right hand, we have not spent much time on our right hand, but it's very straightforward. There are three holes, first, second, third finger, and then our pinky will rest towards the bottom key. Here is what our right hand will look like. This is an example of a clarinet fingering chart. The circles all match a hole on the clarinet. The other keys are all going to match all of the other keys that you see. This line divides the joints. So the top joint is played with the left hand and the bottom joint is played with the right hand. If the circle or key is filled in, you will press down that key or cover that hole. So let's break it down by key. On the left, you see the thumb hole and key. If the hole is covered in, you're going to cover it with your thumb. Towards the right, the first hole is going to be your first finger. The second circle is your second finger. The third circle is your third finger. Same with the right hand. The first circle is your first finger. The second circle is your second finger. The third circle is your third finger. Notice that the fingers never change which hole they are pressing. Remember, if the circles are filled in, those are the holes that you will cover with your fingers. That means if they are not filled in, you will keep your fingers close but not press down the hole. Here's an example of how the fingers will look when they are lifted and when they are pressed down.